some people may be wondering what they can do for God. And let me show you something that I do, which you can do too. What you can do, you can go out and buy some index cards. You know, this is the brand that I get here. And I am sure that there are other types of brands that you can get, but this is what I use. And on these index cards, what you can do is print out scriptures on these index cards. Print whatever scripture you want. Or if you want to, if you don't have a printer, you can hand write them and go to, uh, I forget that store, where you can print out copies. And you can either choose this size right here. What size is this? Three by five. Or you can get this size here. You see this? <laughs> and you can print out what you want on it. And then what you can do when you have them printed out you can place them on people's cars like right under the windshield or windshield wiper <laughs> or what you can do is pass them out to people another thing that you can do i have i print out these documents that i have written i have written most of it and um it is about 60 to 70 pages. When I find out that someone is really interested about God, I usually pass them out to those people if they are interested. And what I do too, I have a Bible ministry where I send people Bibles for free. And what I do when I send them the Bible, I mail out that 70 page paperwork I guess you can say to those people and what I do as well I go on Craigslist and I may place up ads like hey you know free shoes free clothes food whatever else so there are many things that you can do for God like I said in my other videos, when you are helping people, you are helping God as well. Many things that you can do for God. So you don't have to be confused or contemplate too deeply on what you can do for God because there are so many things. So I pray that this makes sense. Index cards. That's it. This is three by five, and I am not sure what size this is. Of course, you can fit much more information on this, but try to make it, but don't try to make it too long because usually people <laughs> who are not really interested in God, they are not going to look or read too much of what you have written. You know, if they see something about repent or about God they may not be too interested so keep it somewhat short or hey if God places it on your heart to make it long hey do as you please but usually I make things short unless you know I am led a certain way so I pray that this makes sense. Many things that you can do for God. Many. God bless.